it is up, everybody. And you better believe it, it's like 80 degrees in Columbus in November. Yes, it is beautiful. It's beautiful. So Hubby did clean the truck out, which is awesome, because this lady right here got a mobile massage. So what is a mobile massage? So a part of my business, now not every massage therapist does it, but I do during the winter because Hobby doesn't work so he can drive me. I go to my client's houses and I perform massages there instead of them coming here. It helps with people that are maybe too immobile, maybe don't like the weather, maybe just don't have time to come here to get one. So I go there, of course, with Hobby's help. I go to my client's house and I work on them in their own home. Okay, so you want to take them out here and show them what you're taking with you today? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Is it on? Yeah. Okay, so you guys, in a mobile massage, you always bring a mobile table with a face rest with the table, a stool, your sheets, lotion or massage gel, paperwork that your client must fill out. So today... And what else now that we're under COVID? Yes, so there's COVID guidelines. So I must wear a mask. I must have a full apron and my client must wear a mask. So I brought a mask just in case he doesn't have one. Okay, I'm gonna show him. You didn't bring the table, right? Okay, so my client is so immobile that he cannot get on the table. Okay, so what is in your little bag here? She does have a, a massage therapist bag. What's in that? So in my bag today is a face rest for my client to use, my paperwork, my apron, my timer so I know the time, and my massage gel. And what else? A thermometer. Oh, uh, yep. So COVID compliance, I must take my client's temperature. I forgot I always have that now. Now, what is the temperature? What what can it be before you have to say no? I have to refuse a massage at 100.5 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, you ready to go? Yep, so let's go do this. Okay, so we're on our way to your mobile massage. Is there a price difference in someone coming to the house and you doing it somewhere else? Yeah, so the price difference is just uh, I add more money onto the massage because I have to pay for gas and my travel time. So right now, it's 20 extra dollars, but if the gas goes up, obviously it will be more. Okay, and do you like the mobiles better than the ones at home or which do you prefer? I like both, I'll tell you why. I am blind, right? Going to work to some somewhere else in our house make me feel normal. Okay, cool. All right, well, we're heading out. We're yep. in the truck, so uh, anything you'd like to say? Hey, with the economy, give your local massage therapist a try. Okay. So a mobile massage is a little difficult for me because I'm blind. So I do depend on hubby and my client a little bit more to set up the table or wash my hands than I would at home. Because at home I know where everything is because it's mine. 
Okay. So what what's the deal with the COVID paperwork? Explain that to them. So the State Medical Board of Ohio and my insurance company have gone together on every massage. I have to wear a mask. My client wears a mask. My client has to take his temperature, his or her temperature. And they must fill out a paperwork form of COVID symptoms and a COVID waiver. So they say it's okay to get a massage, even though they could possibly still get COVID, even if I take all the guidelines, which I do. Okay, so I'm going to show them this. Mm -hmm. It is called the COVID-19 Health Information Consent. Mm -hmm. And uh, basically, they answer all these questions. And one of the questions on here is, have you traveled outside of the United States? Do you now or have you recently had any respiratory symptoms? So it's kind of hard to see until you put it that way. And then but, have you had a fever in the last 24 yep. hours? So the thing I have to watch out for most is any labored breathing at a temperature above 100.5. If I see that, I have to refuse the massage due to the Medical Board of Ohio. Okay, so now all we're doing, we're here, so we just go inside, I help you set up, mm -hmm. and then I leave, correct? Yes, so hubby is not there for the massage, it's just me and my client. Okay, well, do you want to say anything before we end the video? Hey! Like I said, support your local massage therapist. It's tough times. Tough times. <laughs> I appreciate everyone for watching. And always remember, no sight, no problem.